What's up, everybody? I'm Andrew, and this is Mike from uh, AllGamesApparel.com and All Games Mindset. And today we're gonna do uh, worst versus best peanut butter analysis. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, Smucker's peanut butter. Um, this is my favorite brand. I love peanut butter. Peanut butter. My peanut whole butter life so has good. been yeah. Um, this is uh, this is going to be the best. And then we have Skippy Skippy's Cre creamy peanut butter. Oh, ew. And Full it's, of sugar it's really and big. trans fats. It's really big, actually. This is like the bigger one that you yeah, can get. Uh, this it's like is the second uh, biggest. This would be what we call the worst. Um, Even though it's so good. Now, peanut butter is <laughs> one of those things that is often confused on the ketogenic diet, which is the diet that we do. Um, a lot of people assume that just because this has a high fat content and moderate protein content and low carb content that... Is beneficial, but the fact is actually that um, this is some of the worst stuff to have for you. This could be yeah. peanut butter. Um, so if you're gonna have stuff, if you're gonna have commercial brands like that, like definitely Skippy. not not a good option. We're not yeah. really recommended. Yeah, definitely no Skippy, no Jif. Those, yeah, those Jif. Are no... uh, what, what's the other ones called? Uh, there's there's a there's Peter like Pan. Peter Pan. There's yeah. also like Shoprite brands. Shoprite brands. Like, brands. Yeah. All those whole store brands. Like... Actually, I think the Shoprite brand actually doesn't have. Sure. There's there's certain ones that do and certain ones there's they have a natural one like Smucker's does. Yeah, but basically, the difference is that this has a bunch of sugar in it and also is a lot more easier to cause inflammation. Yeah, like I'm gonna read off the body. I'll read off the ingredients right now. So it has roasted peanuts, sugar, high hi, hydro generated vegetable oil. Does that sound like something you <laughs> want in your body? Oh, definitely not. Yeah, because inside so. of that is cotton seed, soybean, and and rapeseed oil. Uh, to prevent separation and salt. Salt is good, but... Salt's good, <laughs> but... <laughs> everything else is, uh... Roasted peanuts are good, good but... <laughs> Roasted peanuts is good, but everything else is, is not good. Now, let's check the ingredients on... S the Smuckers. Smuckers. Peanuts. And salt. I think you could tell the difference here. Let's just, let's show everybody. Let's yeah, so, show everybody yeah, the ingredients. I, I'm Here's the ingredients for the Skippy. Yeah, so this is, this is everything for the Skippy, the nutritional facts... Right there, it's got like three grams. It shows you three grams of sugar on the nutritional facts, and then on the side, it actually shows you what's actually in it. That's the probably the most important part to be looking at is definitely the ingredient side, because that's where you actually see all the problems that you'll be eating. You know, um, that's skipping, and then the Smuckers. Where is it on this one? Oh, it's oh, thank God, it's a huge, huge thing. Get this out of the way. Um, yeah, so this is the Skippy one. This is what does how many calories does that one say? Andrew, the Skippy, this one has 180 calories in it. This one has 190 seven. calories. The calories are not that much different. You know. But the nutri but the ingredients are very different. So yeah. do not be fooled by the macros of the of the product. Yeah. Definitely be looking at the ingredients. The ingredients are probably the most important part. Now the another thing to note is that this is a lot more addicting than that. Yeah. Personally, I've been through most brands. I love peanut butter, as I said, so I've been through most of the brands. That's a lot healthier than this. Yeah. So if you're at the store and you're trying to live a healthier lifestyle, or you know you're beginning to understand this stuff, go for the Smucker's natural peanut butter or uh, Valencia, I think, which is where the the peanut butter Valencia. I've, I think that's what it's called. It's when they don't spray the peanuts on the ground. I don't think the peanuts come from the ground. I think they're they're grown. Well, they're yeah, they're grown above above. So that's even better if you if you find it at your local store. Uh, peanut butter with no sugar in it, but it has but it's like Valencia says Valencia on it. That would be I think I'm pronouncing that right. Hopefully. That's we'll that's we'll actually right better for you because it's not sprayed by any uh any like uh, those anti you know yeah. those anti bug sprays or whatever. Yeah, so it's definitely a lot better, but it's a lot healthier. Yeah, compared to to this, the smugglers are definitely the way to go. This is the best, at least. Of right for peanut right butter, butter for peanut butter wise for for the ketogenic diet we actually recommend mm -hmm. almond almond butter instead in moderate amounts yeah it's less inflammation and it's better it's a better omega three to omega six ratio peanut butter has a lot of omega six fats yeah. but if you're if you're on a like a really tight budget and this will help you you know stay away from sugar then it's a lot better to at least it's better to have a little bit of this not too much moderation yeah, of of this. Long. Than this, you know, be be very careful of the ingredients of the stuff that you're getting at the store, because a lot of things can be very misleading. Yeah, this uh, the and the reason why it's so addicting is because of the sugars. The that sugar are in makes it, it like, like just makes you just keep. Yeah. You have a spoonful, 
and then you'll you're have another school stop. So I, I know from experience, it's very hard to stop you know, peanut butter. You'll be watching a movie and having some peanut butter. Next thing you know, you finish the, the whole thing and you're just questioning your and, existence. And you and you, you will not feel that good after you're done. No, definitely, are. definitely. If not. you are bulking, if you're trying to bulk and you're not on keto, uh, I would I would definitely sure recommend if, if you're trying to get some calories and regular peanut butter is the way to go. But I want to say again that. There's no reason to con- to consume Skippy's peanut butter unless it's like for a, a pleasure food. Yeah. What if we get sued by Skippy's? <laughs> what, that'd, be, yeah, that'd be a really funny thing. That would. Uh, uh, I guess we are, mm-hmm. and we are not definitely sponsored by Smuckers, but we're not sponsored. But you know, we're just, trying, we're to, just we're trying, trying to give to you facts about you. what you know is better for you and not better for you. Yeah. It, it'll be mostly the sugar companies that'll be after us. But it's okay. It's all good because you know. We're doing the right thing. We do it for you. We, uh, we're just trying to get spread the word. Uh, so our analysis says Smuckers is the best. Smuckers is the best peanut butter to go. Um, definitely is the winner with these two. If, yeah, if um, you need peanut butter, go for the Smuckers Natural. If you're really, if you're having, I guess, a cheat day or something, I guess you can go for the Skippies. Or but definitely, but just, you should try to stay just, away from yeah, it. Just at all don't costs. even have it like in your pantry or, or wherever you put your your peanut butter. Yeah. It's just better to just it's not best to have avoid. It it's best your, to not nuts. buy it at the store. Whatever means necessary, yeah. just don't buy it. If you're bulking, trying to gain muscle, take the you know consume the regular peanut butter with no sugar because sugar does nothing for you. It only makes everything worse. Yes. So that's basically all for this video. And uh, if you like this, like and subscribe and comment your thoughts on peanut butter and your experiences. And we will talk to you soon.